Hello my friends and welcome to a new game called My Little Riding Champion. They reached out to me and asked if I would like to play their game and I said yes, of course I would. This looks super fun. Look at this guy. Already. There's, there's even a cow watching us in the background. It does not get any better than that I would say. I don't know a whole lot of what I'm in for. Horse riding is the gist that I get. Um, so let's just dive in. Oh, where's this beautiful location? There's two waterfalls, not one, two. Magic is happening. A beautiful day is dawning. Chapter one, arrival. Oh, this is me. Oh, oh. the riding stable is very different from what I remember of it. Uncle must have put a lot of work into it. Too bad he's not here anymore. I'll take good care of it. Well, number one, there's voices. <laughs> number two, what happened to uncle? Hey, who's that man over there? To talk to him, I have to go into the marker next to him and use the displayed control for interaction. All right, I get it. And I'm so glad I don't have to make up voices for these The characters. site is marked with an X symbol on the small map at the bottom right of the screen. I am displayed there as an arrow. Okay. The task will be displayed in the task field until I've completed it. If I've got several tasks to do at the same time, only the main task is displayed there. Thank you, Louisa. I can use the displayed control at any time to open the mission booklet and see what... This is my mission booklet. Here you can see my current task. I'm supposed to move into the marker beside the man to talk to him. That's my current main task. As you can see, there's a lot of side tasks that I can still tackle. And even a treasure hunt. A treasure hunt. Great. So when can I start taking is. all these tasks on? Close the mission booklet by clicking on the button with the green check. Got it. Oh. This, this is gonna be a little... Oh, I can run with shift. Ooh, that guy looks kind of mean. Hello, Louisa. Did you arrive safely? I'm Frank, hey, Frank, and I was a very good friend of your uncle's. Have you looked around yet? No, my main task was to come stand with you. Hello, Frank. My trip was fine, but I haven't really had a chance to look around yet. I want to make my character. Then I'll show you around. To the riding school was your uncle's pride and joy. He had no children, and you were his only niece, so he left it to you. I'm gathering that he must have passed away. That big building over there is the house with your room. You can do various things in your room, like finish the current day and save the current game. Saving is important, thank you. You can also change your t-shirts, yes. jeans, shoes, and riding gear if you have some in your wardrobe. Change clothes. You can also change your hair color there. Ooh, I want to change my hair color. There's a mailbox in front of the house. Use the displayed control for interaction to get your mail out of it. I like that it has a little horse on top. Do you see the longish building next to the house? That's the stable for your horses. The one we're standing in you front of, You can store Frank? horse riding accessories like saddles, <laughs> bridles, and saddle blankets at the back of the stable. Cool. The stable normally holds up to six horses, but most of the boxes need repairing, uh -huh. so only one is available right now. Oh, uh, we'll have to work on that. If you want to buy new boxes, just drop by my shop in oh, the village. I want to build them. I'm the local dealer here for horses and equestrian equipment. Great. Is there a riding club here? I've loved riding since I was a kid. Yep, there certainly is. Your uncle was the president of the club for many years. After his death, I took over the chairmanship. But without him, it's just not the same. No. Poor Frank. What do you mean? Your uncle was a great person, but he was also an excellent show jumper. Wow. He won a lot of prizes and brought in funds and donations to support the club. Funding just doesn't come in without a local champion, and we're in bad shape. I'm afraid we'll have to close the riding club soon. No, we can help. That's terrible. Is there anything I can do? The club has to win the major tournament this year to survive. No pressure. But the competition's extremely strong. Cornelia has won every title for the last five years. Beating her will be a heck of a challenge. Cornelia. I see a rivalry brewing. Great. I love challenges. She's so excited about Where everything. Where do we start? Great challenges. Yes. Battles. Yay. Work. Hurrah. You'd really help us? Well, that's great. 
Your uncle had a horse you could train with, but it disappeared after your uncle died, and no one knows where it is. Better check the stable entrance. Maybe you'll be lucky and find its tracks. I'll wait for you. So you've done zero to, to look for this horse once it disappeared. I should start by looking at the stable entrance. Yes, that's what he said. Okay. Oh, okay. Here are some tracks on the ground, and they still look pretty fresh. I hope I find it quickly. We don't have much time, because the tournament starts soon. Soon? How soon? I'm not ready. Find your horse in the forest. I kind of like that I don't have to hold the button down to move the camera. But it does uh, make for a little wonky movement. There it is! What a unique looking horse you are, my friend! Hey! Here you are! Frank didn't even tell me your name. What am I supposed to call you? Or can we make something up? Yes, we can. Give your horse a name. Chris, what should I name my horse? Uh, piggy feet. Huh? Piggy feet. Piggy feet? Pigeon. Pigeon? What are you saying to me? Pigeon feet. Pigeon flower. I'm going to do this, I guess. Pigeon flower. Don't worry. You'll be home soon. All right. Let's get back to my riding stable. Well, what have we here? Is that Cornelia? Cor I keep wanting to say Cordelia, but this is not Buffy. Oh, hello. I'm Louisa. And who are you? Who am I? I'm just the five-time winner of the big annual show jumping tournament. And the title holder this year, too. You don't have to be snobby about it. Cornelia's my name. I'm sure you've heard of me. Oh, yes. Frank mentioned you were in the tournament, too. Too? You don't really want to compete against me, do you? Oh, we do. Do you actually think that you have even a slight chance against me? It doesn't matter. I'm still gonna, I'm still gonna fight you. I am determined <laughs> to participate and win. Yes, perfect. I am determined to participate and win. Ha! Don't make me laugh. I'm sure you don't even know how to ride a horse right, and that you can steer it with the displayed controls. With the displayed controls? Now she's attacking me and my gaming skills here. Not just the character in the game. She's attacking me personally. And you certainly don't know that every time the displayed control is activated, the horse chooses a faster gait. And every time the displayed control is pressed, its gait gets slower again. And I bet you've never heard that the displayed control gets the horse to jump either. Well, she just told us how to play, I guess. She could, maybe she's sabotaging us. Is this actually how movement works in the game? I don't know. Ha! You probably don't even know that you mount and dismount using this control. Not to mention that your horse loses more endurance the faster it goes and has to rest and go slower when the endurance display is empty. Oh, endurance. Oh, no. Mm. Well, of course I know how to ride a horse. I rode almost every day in my childhood. Your childhood probably was before your club's last victory. Ah, I've wasted enough time here. See you at the tournament. Okay, fine. Bye. Bye. Bye, Cornelia. Thanks for giving us all the instructions That was on a friendly a encounter. Horse. I am a little rusty, though. But that's something we can fix, isn't it? We're gonna need some practice, I think. I'm a little confused. Lucky for me, our new acquaintance didn't realize she was actually telling me how to do it right. Not very clever of her. I should mount up and go back to the riding stable. Use the displayed control for mounting and dismounting. F is mount and dismount, okay. Nice. You All can right. now see some new displays at the top of the screen. I can. The yes. top bar shows you the level of progress. The number to the left of the bar is its current level. Mm -hmm. And the number to the right of it is the next level. Below that is the endurance display. The faster you ride, the faster the horse loses endurance. Just walk the horse or stop, and it will recover. The higher this level is, the more endurance a horse has. Okay. The heart symbol indicates the horse's contentment. Content if a horse is dirty, it becomes oh. discontent and may no longer jump or gallop. In my stable, I can take care of it and always make it feel good. 
I use the displayed control to move forward, and with each press of this displayed control, I can increase its speed from a walk to a trot to a gallop. Let's do this. The horse's chosen gait is displayed to the right of the bars. Okay, move forward. Oh, all right. This is... I change into a trot by using the displayed control. Shift is to go faster. Okay, I can do that. Hey, this works great. Go forward. I have to use this control again to ride at a fast trot. I'm sure it'll help me in competitions. I should change to a gallop and give it a try. So I use the displayed control again to change to a gallop, and then use it once more to move into the fastest gallop. Oh, I'm... No. I've it too many times. <laughs> and it closed out the game. Oh, we are pros at this. Oh, hey, really fast. But it uses up a lot of endurance. Oh. When my horse gets tired, I should change to a walk or even stop to increase the endurance level. Okay. So I just use the display control several times to change to a slower pace each time. Control. But now back to the riding stable. It Obstacles can usually be overcome with the display control because then my horse will jump. Okay, I get it. But my horse is still too discontent right now. So jumping is out. Oh. So if I don't press control to slow down and just let go of W, it stops abruptly. Okay. Noted. We are back. Thanks for yeah, waiting, Frank. Back. I see you found the horse. Very nice. Yeah, it was all alone in the forest. And we met I see you two have already got to know each other pretty well. You really do have a knack for horses, Louisa. But it got pretty dirty on that little trip. You can't enter the tournament like this. Do you see its heart symbol? It's not completely full anymore. Here's where you can clean your horse. Ride your horse into the marker and use the display. Care increases contentment and fills up the heart symbol. If your horse is content, it will follow all your orders. I have to clean my horse now. Okay. All right. You are now in the cleaning view. Oh, he's so cute. Here you can see all the tasks you have to do to keep your horse in top condition. Once you have completed a task, it will okay, clean the, the rough dirt off first. Just run the brush over. Dusty, Very dusty. good. Okay. Now, let's do now you sponge. can move the sponge like. Spongy, spongy, spongy. As the last step, so now move the hoof pick several times over the small lumps to clean. We got it. Excellent. Very good. Your horse is clean and beautiful. You should always make sure that your horses are so well groomed. <laughs> if you neglect them, they'll become discontent and, and will no, no longer obey, obey all, all your commands. commands. You can check the status of your horses in the horse overview by using the display. Horse overview? Here you can see your horse and all oh. the necessary information about it, I like its name, horses. endurance, contentment, and level. You can call up the horse overview at any time and click on the done button. Pigeon flower, he's so cute. Now that your horse is clean again, you can start training right away. Nearby is your own training ground, which you can always use. My son Martin is waiting for you there to explain the basics. Here's Thanks. the map oh. of the area. Oh, good. When you use the displayed control, the map opens up. Use it to find your destination safely and to orient yourself. You can always see the smaller overview map. Thank you. My horse and... and what map. a great map. Oh, cool. The training ground should be close by. I just hope I'm not too rusty. Can we jump? <gasps> yes! <laughs> Jeez. Okay. Beautiful. <laughs> Oops, too soon. I jumped too soon. I'm sorry. Oh, good. At least he doesn't... Bump into things and then it takes up uh, 10 years to recover. Hello, Martin. Hello, you must be Martin. Hey, you must be Luisa, our new club member. I'll tell you a little bit about the tournament and the training ground. I can't place his accent. The tournament consists of three classes, beginner, advanced, and expert, with three competitions each. You must win all nine competitions to win the tournament. Competing beginner, advanced, and expert. That's not how that works. You must always finish first in the competition of the tournament to be able to participate in the next competition. We're doomed. And your horse must have reached the necessary level. 
So use the training ground to advance your horse to the necessary level. The horse can only gain experience for competitions on the training ground. To reach a higher level for your horse, you have to complete the training course, called a parkour, without getting too many points for fouls. All right so far? Maybe. Yes, I understand. Before starting your training, you can choose a parkour to train on. At the moment, you're only at the level 1 parkour, That's so true. you can't choose another one yet. But during the tournament, you can unlock new parkours, which you can buy from a father in the village at his vendor stand. Now, select the first parkour, as later in the tournament, you'll be against the clock. Try to take the obstacles as quickly as possible, mm -hmm. but pay attention to their sequence, the endurance of the horse, and try to avoid getting fall points. This seems much more complicated than Star Stable. Huh? No, they have voices! I don't have to read their text. You'll get fall points if you don't take an obstacle correctly. Every fault has a negative effect on your end time, your training then fails, and you'll have to repeat it. This is a lot of pressure. I'm getting a little nervous here. I was very mean to Cornelia, and I shouldn't have been. Oh, oh. We're ready. Pigeon Flower and I are ready. Oh. Did we do it? Nice. I'm going relatively slow, but... Ooh. Oh no, we did really bad. We knocked that one down. We came in at a weird angle. It's my fault, Pigeon Flower. It's my fault. Trading on success! That didn't go so well. Just try it again. I only knocked down one! That went okay. That went okay, right? I guess we can speed up a little here. I'm gonna maybe slow down again so we don't mess it up too bad. Okay, run! Run, boy, run! Successful again. I was so distraught. <laughs> oh, I have to do it again? Okay. Oh no! Can I restart? He's mad at me. He did really bad. Just run through them all now. There's no point. <laughs> that didn't go so well. Just try it again. Yeah, yeah, I, I am. That was okay. Oh no, I let go of W. There's a lot of flies. I hear a lot of flies in the background. <laughs> I guess that's normal for horses. Yes! But we did better that time, I think, right? Oh, we leveled up! Hey, that was great! Do you feel ready for your first competition? No, not at all! I don't know. A little more practice might be a good thing. Don't worry, you still have time to train. I thought we were going now. Just meet me outside the tournament hall when you're ready. Then we can really get into the tournament. I've got something special for you. A riding helmet in our club colors. I'm sure you'll need it for the tournament. Hey, that's cool. Thanks a lot. Yes. You've completed all the tasks in this chapter. You can end the day in your room, lead a guided tour in a horse-drawn coach, or go shopping, or just explore the equestrian countryside. Okay, that's a lot. Cool beans. Oh. Does it go here, where this horse is? Oh, what a pretty miniature. I'll pick it up. Oh. Who knows what it might be good for? We got a collectible. Oh, good, so she writes in her little journal when we save it. Oh, so we have a lot of practice to do before we can do the tournament. That is for sure. We are going to have to check it out next time, because we're out of time for today. Especially, oh, hello. Especially maybe the 
I need to carriage. go to the marker in front of my wardrobe and use the displayed control for interaction. Well, can we check out her new helmet and then we'll sign off? That might be a good idea. Here's my wardrobe. There's not much in it yet, but I'm sure I'll fill it up soon. Oh. There are two sections here. Leisure wear and... So you can have... Oh, she can have blue hair. I'm for it. Oh. I don't know how I feel about any of these shirts. What is this? Oh, a vest. Oh. These are quite the outfit choices. Okay. But what about... Oh, because we're doing leisure wear. And she said we can also choose riding wear. Here I put on my tournament clothes. Okay. Helmet, jacket, jot purse, and riding boots. I can buy more tournament clothes later in the village and put them together myself. Use the button with the green check mark to close the wardrobe. Okay. That must be the club one. Oh, I like both of those. Ooh, I don't know about the green, my friend. <laughs> okay, I have to get my horse now. It's standing outside the stable. Well, we're gonna save for now, I think, and finish up next time. Game saved. Excellent. But thank you guys so much for watching. If you're having fun playing this game, you can find it now on Steam and on consoles. And what does this say? I'm not sure. It's something 1964. But we're gonna check it out some more next time. But thank you so much for watching. We'll see you later. Bye!